Hello and welcome to my most requested video. So <clears throat> by now you have most likely optimized your in-game settings and you still want more FPS. So next step you need to take the limit off from the frame rate. So for some reason when this limits the FPS your processor gets limited and in raid situation you might be having like 30 FPS and once you take this off you might have 50 FPS. I don't know how that really works but it's a spaghetti code, so don't question it, it just works, like it somehow just limits the processor. So yeah, it's a really easy thing to do, just close your game. And go in the files, your computer, your files, BNS. NC West. There should be client configuration. You want to edit with Notepad. You hit Ctrl F, you type in frame rate, and you look for that. And there it is. In there, you just want to type 0. Once you do that, obviously, remember to save the file. Once you do that, you have unlimited FPS. And this should work on most of the processors that are somewhat okay. If you have four cores or more, this will definitely work. If you have less cores than four, then this might not help you at all. You might even want to limit Limit the FPS with this one if you are hitting 100% usage on the processor while playing the game. Just keep lowering this until you are at 90%. Because if you are constantly running against 100%, you might get freezing and lagging and stuff like that. So you really don't want that. But yeah, next step. Now that you are having way too many FPS, you want to limit the FPS. My personal best FPS, by the way, is almost 2000 FPS in the pin code screen. So your graphics card is doing way too much work for nothing. So you want to download NVIDIA Profile Inspector if you're using NVIDIA. If you're using AMD, then you have to google the program for that, I don't know which one it is, never used it. Once you have downloaded this, you just go in here, and it's sim as simple as this. You just limit the frames wherever you want, and you have to have the game closed again. And you just apply changes and that's it. Your frames will be limited next time when you open the game. And then your graphics card is not doing extra work for nothing and just wasting energy. So that's it for this one. I guess... or well... Actually, if your graphics card is not too good, if that's running like at 100%, you might as well limit the frame rates with the uh, NVIDIA inspector. Just limit until that one is around 90% usage as well. Because same thing with that, if you, if you are running 100%, game might be freezing and all, kind, all kinds of other stuff like stuttering. And the best way to check this is with MSI Afterburner, at least I use this one. 
you can see the CPU usage and GPU usage. Always try to keep these below 90%. So yeah, there is still more advices and stuff how to get more FPS, but those will be way more advanced than this one, so I'll, I'll be making another video later on at some point. But yeah, thanks for watching and see you later.